member for Vancouver, Point Grey. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. In 1908, the province of British Columbia passed the BC University Act. The Act provided for the establishment of a new university that would provide, quote, such instruction in all branches of liberal education as may enable students to become proficient in science, commerce, arts, literature, law, medicine, and all other branches of knowledge. It was an ambitious goal, to be sure, but one that has been ably met by the university's teachers, researchers, administrators, and students for more than 100 years, as UBC celebrates its centenary this year. In 1913, the university's first president, Dr. Frank Westbrook, was appointed. Dr. Westbrook set the tone for UBC as a school interested not just in research and learning, but how that research and learning affects daily life. As an expert in public health, Dr. Westbrook was a champion of the idea of chlorinating water to sterilize it, reflecting his engagement in public life linked directly to his research that I am certainly thankful for today. In 1918, the first issue of the now famous UBC was published. Their first headline was, quote, Freshman reception, Frosh have the opportunity to shake hands with important personages. It is my hope that the local MLA was among those important personages, both as a demonstration of commitment to the community, but also how it's unchanging that Frosh see the local MLA as an important personage. From a school of all white men studying in shacks in Fairview in 1915 to, to today's beautiful Point Grey and Okanagan campuses in 2015 with cutting edge research facilities and diverse faculty and students from all over the world, UBC has come a long way in 100 years. I'm honored and proud to have been a very small part of this tradition as an adjunct professor in the Allard School of Law. And I can say based on experience that UBC students are up to the challenge of the school's motto, Tum S. In Latin, it's up to you. They're ready to change the world. Honorable Speaker, congratulations to UBC on 100 years of success, teaching, researching, and building tomorrow's economy for our province today. Thank you.